Okay, so we've got this question here. Uh, question 13, we need to solve this quadratic. Now it's a quadratic because it's got squared in it. So that tells me I'm looking for two solutions instantly. I need two answers, even though there's only one space down here. Now, normally I would try and solve quadratics. Well, one way to try and solve them is to factorize. Um, another way is to use a graph, but that doesn't seem very appropriate in this case, it's not very exact. One way is called to complete a square, it's kind of like an A and A star topic. And there's one way that it's that you've got to use the formula. Now, if you go back to the beginning, you get that formula. Um, and actually, we've got it here. So if you look on your formula sheet, We get the formula here, quadratic equation formula. Okay, so you can always look it up if you can't remember it. Now, how do you know which one of those methods? Oops. Which one of those methods to use? Well, I like to use this one. This one's always my first choice if you can. Okay, but it does say the hint is to three significant figures. Now that implies you can use a calculator. So that means in this question we're going to use the formula. So let's write the formula out, copy it from the from the book or the formula book or the formula page. Minus b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus v all over 2a. Where in this case my a is 3, the number in front of the x squared. My b is 2. And my C is minus 4. So I'm going to go forward and put all my numbers into this calculation. X equals the opposite of B or my negative B, which is 2. Plus or minus square root of B squared. So 2 squared is 4 minus 4 times A times C. So 4 times that is 12. 12 times minus 4 is minus 48. So that becomes plus 48. Be very careful with that and make sure you do it correctly. All over 2 lots of a which is my 6. So all those looks quite complicated. Actually if you go a little bit step by step it's not so bad. So x is 2 plus or minus the square root of 52 all divided by 6. Now oh I wanted my minus b, made a mistake here. This should be minus 2, and this should be minus 2 here, because I wanted minus b, and b was 2, so I wanted the opposite. Minus 2, I said it, but I didn't do it. Now, this is where I get my two answers. I do with calculation once, looking at the positive, minus 2 plus root 52, divide that by 6. It gives me one answer. I did the negative root for my second answer. So, just use my calculator for this. So, therefore, x is equal to taking the plus root, gives you to mine as 0.869 to three significant figures or x is if I do the negative root minus 2 minus square root of 30, uh, 52 x is equal to minus 1.54 to three significant figures so um, two answers both the three significant figures and that my tip of solving this was using the formula because I knew it said, well, one, it's quite complicated, but two, it also said, so it's got three here, makes it a little bit more annoying. Also says, correct the three sigma figures, or if it says decimal places, you can use the formula. Check the front of your sheet, so you don't actually have to learn this, you just have to know how to use it.